Blue Class family. Let's go ahead and look at our message. Are you ready? Follow along with your eyes and listen with your ears. Use your finger to point. Let's start with the date. Ready? January 26, 2021. Dear class family, today is Tuesday. First, we will read Little P. Then we will notice how characters can be different. Next, we will go to Fles class. Last, we will do I Ready, Love Miss Joyner. All right, so we have a lot of special things we're gonna be working on this morning. Let's go ahead and as we're reviewing the message, we are going to be boxing the capital letters. So I want you to look carefully with me. Let's go ahead and we're gonna start with the date. Do you remember where the date is? All right, kindergartners, read it with me. January 26, 2021. What capital did you see? That is right, the capital J. You're right. We always start a month with a capital letter. It's very special and important, so we have the first month, January, with a capital J. Let's look at our greeting. Dear class family, what did you notice? The D in dear. We always start our greeting with dear and a capital D. And what did I use to describe you? That's right. You are my class family. So do you see the capital letters? Let's go ahead and we're going to box the capital C and the capital F. Now, look at the first sentence. At the beginning of every sentence, what do we need to remember to do? We need to start with a capital letter. What capital letter starts the sentence right here? A capital T, like T top T. Today is Tuesday. Do you notice another capital letter in that sentence? I do as well. Look at the day of the week. What is right here? Capital T. Remember, we always capitalize the days of the week. They're special and important. Let's go ahead and continue. Look at this sentence that starts with the word first. What do you notice at the beginning here? That's right, a capital F. We always start with a capital letter. And for this sentence, first we will read little p. It starts with a capital letter F. Notice the title of the book that we're reading, Little P. What do you notice about these letters? There is a capital L. And what else do you notice here? A capital P, right. Remember how we talked about the title of a book has capital letters for the beginning part of the word for, for the, the title part. So little has a capital L and the other word P has a capital P. Let's continue. Then we will notice how characters can be different. At the beginning of this sentence, what did you see here? You're right, a capital T for then. So we will be reading little p, and what we'll be doing is we're gonna be noticing how characters can be different. And in this book, I want you to look at the character. Look at the main character, it's a little p. Have you ever eaten peas before? Hmm, do you know what a pea is? This book is called Little P, and today when we read this book, we are going to be noticing how characters can be different. And we will also, after we do that, let me share with you what we're doing. Ready? Next, we will go to Fles class. Did you notice the capital letters in that sentence? You're right, the N, N, not, N, N, the N here for next. And we will go to FLES class. When you have your foreign language class today, you'll be going to Spanish class. And I notice for the foreign language class, there are some capital letters. What capital letters do you see in the word here, FLES? What is here? 
a capital F, then a capital L, A, E, and then a S. You're right. All right, let's continue. Last, we will do I ready. The beginning here, what do you notice? The start of the sentence does have a capital L. And when we're gonna be doing I ready, oh, I noticed the capital R there. So when you're doing I ready, remember that's when we're gonna be going on the resource page. And we're gonna be going to I ready to take the I ready reading diagnostic today. All right, so you're gonna be working on that. So we have I ready. And also the final thing we need to box. Did you notice any capitals in my closing and signature? Love, Miss Joyner. What did you notice? The capital L for love, you're right. And look at my signature, Miss Joyner. What did you notice? The capital M and the capital J. That's right. Remember, we always capitalize names. They're special and important. Okay, communicators, today when you are sharing your answers and your work. It is so important that you make great choices at school. What you're going to need to remember to do is put your microphone button on so that we can hear what you have to say and what you're thinking. And if you are asking a question or answering a question or showing me you're at your laptop, press the raise the hand button one time so that it turns purple and I know that you want my attention, okay? And also when you're sharing your work, remember, put your video camera on so that we can see it. Okay, class family, let's go ahead and have a fantastic day. Ready? Fantastic.